I'm about seven days out from month three. Um, I'm so excited. I did not do a video over month two because nothing really was going on. So I didn't really have much to say. Um, but month three, I got a retighten and I went to a new loctician. So that was interesting. So I want to talk to you today about my loctician and what I've noticed about my locks. So first thing I've noticed about my locks is my dry, itchy scalp. So it really wasn't that bad month one, but it's it's gotten bad. And if you look close, you can see my little flakes and all that jazz. So I am going to wash my hair today. My, that is my remedy for dry, itchy scalp is just to wash it, get it really clean, and it usually stop itch it stops itching for at least three to four days by day five six and seven it's starting to itch again and it's time for another wash so it's definitely it's day nine i think since i last washed it so it's definitely time for a wash and i'm going to do that today um but let me tell you about my new loctician she's really nice i really enjoyed her um, she was able to give me a flat rate, which I was excited about because I don't want to go to someone and, you know, they're overcharging or they take their time because they're getting paid by the hour anyway. So I didn't really want to do that. So she was able to give me a fixed rate and I really appreciated that. Um, so what happened in the locks is I forgot something and I forgot that I am supposed to separate my locks. So this retightening was pretty painful. Um, because she, when, as she was doing it, she had to go in and separate them. I had a lot of marrying and everybody loved the next person. So because they were loving on each other, they didn't really want to get a divorce. So it was pretty painful, this retightening, but I've learned my lesson. And she was saying that it's best to, it's best to separate them, especially after a wash. So after I wash my hair today, I'm going to come back and I'm going to show you how I think is a good method to separate my locks. Um, but until then, or other than that, I'm still really enjoying my locks. I haven't really done anything to them. I have like this little straight piece. I mean, it's kind of wanting to be curly. Where did it? Wait. Okay. It's kind of wanting to be curly, but it is, it's damaged hair. So, you know, I have those few pieces and I did have some that were coming down and it was like from here down, it was like a loose natural pattern. And so my loctician, she was able to go in and, and fix all that and re lock it, I guess is the term. Um, she was able to re lock it. And so they all look pretty good. I've been feeling around and I thought I felt a um, a knot at the end of one of them, but I wasn't near a mirror to really look. I think I was driving in my car. My hands are always in my hair. Um, so I, I don't know where it is now. I've kind of forgotten. But other than that, everything's been going really well. I did do one style. And because the holidays are coming up, I am planning to do maybe one or two more styles. So I look forward to showing you how I do those styles. And, oh, I counted my locks. Boop, 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 boop. Actually, I did not do it. My friends did it, two of them. Um, I just did not have the patience to count my own locks. I have, ready? 506 locks. Woo! So excited. Um, I actually, at the time they counted, these over here were not locked, so it might actually be like 508, um, because these two were just loose, they, they just came down, 
and I think she retightened or she relocked them. My new loctician, I think she relocked them when I went back. Um, so it might actually be 508, but whatever the case, I have 506 locks. So definitely excited about that. I hope to keep them all. Hopefully, none of them fall out as they grow heavy. But I am about to wash my hair, do my thing, and then I'll come back and show you guys how I plan on separating um, my locks and keeping them from getting married to each other. Because we, we ain't married. All the single ladies, all the single locks. Okay? Alright, so, I'll be back. Okay, you guys, I am back. I have washed my hair and I love... I love a fresh wash because I love the way um, the locks just shake around and move. So I have a fresh wash, but this section has not been separated yet. So when I first thought about in my mind how I wanted to separate it, I wanted to go through and do rows like this and then go through each row separating them apart. So again, take another row. So this might work for some. However, I don't know. It's, it works okay for me, but I kind of went between this method and between just holding it here and doing it one at a time. But with 506 locks, this one can kind of seem very monotonous. Um, which brings me to my first con. I was not expecting to do this much work. I thoroughly enjoyed it when all I had to do was braid and band, wash it, and then take my braids out and let it air dry. Um, so there you go. More work for me. Yay. But it's really not that bad really not that bad plus it will help oh i got a piece of lint or something in my hair maybe pet hair whatever i'm um, glad i was able to take it out there's a little white spot full of i don't know what it's full of dry skin maybe um so i hate that that's happening on my edges because i mean that's the part that people can see um so but that's okay. I will continue with my regimen. And doing these. I'm really happy because these two are staying put so far. Um, my two edges. Well, kind of I say that. This one looks like it's coming down a little. And this one might be staying a little bit more than it has been in the past. So, that's really good. Alright, so that... And then I also wanted to mention um, length check. So I haven't really done a lot of like true length checks since having my sister locks. I mean, I'm only three months in, so was, I mean, it hasn't done anything. And I understand that it grows out before it grows long. However, um, I really don't want to focus on the length check. And the length of my hair and grow 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 um, because while I was a loose natural I feel like that's all I did was I talked about how much I wanted my hair to grow how much I wanted it to grow and you know it grew but then it's like okay now what so I feel like I missed out on part of the journey by focusing so much on the length so I don't want to focus that hard anymore this is another method i'm using probably just because my hands are tired um just to hold or slip one row to the side or one bunch to the side while i do the other part um so this is the last row and i did have some marrying in there so i'm glad i did all right you guys can see the middle part on me it's hideous um <laughs> I actually did try to wear the middle part one day and I was just, my hair didn't even want to do it. It was just not acting right. So back to the side we go. Oh, I did find, hold on, hold on, hold on. 
Hold on. I found the one that I think. There it is. Yes. This is the one that I think may be, um, may have a little knot on the end. So, woohoo! Yay for knots! Um, I'm going to try to leave it there. Hopefully, if I don't play my hair too much, then it won't move. But anyways, that is it. I guess I'll do my little link check real quick. So, right now, it's here about to my collarbone for the back left corner of my hair um, middle hmm. down to my chin bottom of my chin and I guess I'll do a side one I'll do this side and so here I don't know what to call that middle of my neck ish you can't even hardly see it yeah so middle of my neck ish so, anyways, you guys, I'm still loving my locks. I enjoy it every single day. I'm going to try to um, do a styling video, some different styles. I have tried one other style, but I want to do some more, especially with the holidays coming up. So, I hope to get that to you. It probably won't be done before the holidays, but you can use it for other holidays, like your birthday or Easter, New Year's, or something like that. St. Patrick's Day, whatever. Um, so, I'll try to get those out to you. Other than that, enjoy your day. Everywhere that I go, everywhere that I be, if you were not surrounding me with your energy, I don't want to be there, don't want to be anywhere, any place that I can feel you. I just want to be near you And yes, I'm a mess But I'm blessed to be stuck with you oh. Sometimes it gets unhealthy We can't be by ourselves We will always need each other Yes, I'm a mess But I'm blessed to be stuck with you I just want you to know that Alright, so they have counted 500 subs.